Dude, I gotta be honest. I've just been in a creative rut lately. I don't know what I wanna film. I'm over here just overthinking and just not getting out there and fucking doing it. I just think, 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 what should I do? What video should I make? What should I talk about? And I'm realizing the more I do this, the more paralyzed I feel and the more blocked my creativity is. And that's why yesterday I decided to just publish that podcast. It's totally random, but I had a good time with my friends and I just wanted to play around. I wanna play around with new microphones, new styles of videography, try some editing out, you know? And that basically segues into what I wanna talk about today. I did think about this a little bit. And that's this feeling I have that I am essentially a hobby hopper. I am constantly changing my pursuits, the things I like to do. And that's how I ended up with this thing. <laughs> my buddy gave me a $100 guitar and I have been learning how to play it for the past three weeks now. And I'm gonna give you guys a little bit of an example of that. Holy shit, I just stuttered. I'm gonna show you guys what I've been practicing and then talk about this whole hobby hopping phenomenon that's in my head. But let me serenade you real quick with a little bit of cowboy beginner chords. And I promise you this is gonna sound bad. <laughs> No, but dude, I promise you, this shit is so hard. Playing the guitar is crazy difficult. But that's why I love trying out new stuff. Like, I have no business playing a guitar. I'm not a musician at all. I'm good with the computer, I'm good with the camera, but this music business is not me. But since I've been learning how to play guitar, now when I see a live band, I'm like, damn, dude. This musician is a musician. Like I can see and appreciate more their passion, their skill and their ability, their creativity, all these things. And I know you guys have noticed that. There is not a single thing out here on this earth that you cannot go to the nth degree. You can go full parabolic with anything like microphone technology, gravel driveways, building furniture, clothing, um, I don't know, being an optometrist, like literally anything that you think about on this earth, people are really good at it. And that takes time, energy, effort, learning, creativity, all these things. And I think for me, that's what's drawn me to these new hobbies all the time. I love just discovering shit, trying stuff out. And sure, that's fun, it's awesome. I mean, I feel like I've learned a lot about a lot of random stuff. I'm kind of a jack of all trades but I'm a master of none. And that's why this bothers me because I guess for lack of a better word or the best way I can explain it, it's because society only approves of people who are at the upper echelon of whatever they're doing. Like people love a really good musician. They love a really good videographer. That's when you get approval, I guess. And for me, what's bothering me, especially as I'm getting older, I mean, I'm almost 30 now, I'm thinking in my head like, damn, dude, you gotta just pick a lane and stay in it. But that is just not me my whole life. I've switched up hobbies and I've had a good time doing it. And honestly, a lot of those hobbies have stuck with me. Cycling, running, videography, all these things have stayed with me and I would have never found them if I didn't try different things, but the cost of that is that I haven't mastered any of them. And I'm sure by the time I do, I'll probably be 80 and on my way out. <laughs> so I don't know, I'm just at a loss right now. I'm hoping that one of you can relate to this video because I know I'm not the only person out there who likes to try stuff and experiment, but man, it does come with a cost and I'm, I'm really in my head about this right now because I see a lot of my friends and people in my family who have really excelled at their thing. And it's a beautiful process to watch, but I'm staying true to myself, man. And for that reason, I'm learning how to play the chords. I got a C for you, an A. 
Adi, Aji. <laughs> I mean, dude, I promise you I'm gonna get better at this. I'm having a good time with it though. I hope you guys can appreciate this video. I hope it makes sense to you, what I'm saying here. I'm a hobby hopper. And you know what? I'm just accepting of that. But at the same time, like all of you, like all of us, I'm second guessing myself. I'm constantly thinking the grass is greener. And I'm wondering what the hell I should do. A 28 year old guy, single, lost in the world, sitting in the middle of some random warehouse with a shitty guitar and a really nice mic, <laughs> playing, I don't even know what this song is, it's just chords. But you know what? I'm having a good time with it. How about that? Thank mm -hmm. you.